Hey guys. Uh, almost got overlooked in today's whole halabaloo. Uh, something new because it's written two new things, which means this guy has a costume, Rasulla. So let's look at that. But before that, he's already there. So let's look at this one. Zela Lay has a costume. So from dagger holding chick, dodger, she becomes a monk. Holy. Um, costume bonus is 2241, which is not even worth a mention. So I'll skip that. This remains the same. Yeah. Stats are similar. You can actually see fish bone blades at fast speed becomes aquatic dance at fast speed. 185 damage to enemies on the edges of the formation becomes 215 damage to the enemies on the edges. And 30% um, defense in the costume used to be 34% defense for three turns. So that's it. <laughs> There's nothing else to say. <laughs> uh, basically the same hero. I'll leave it at that. But yes, the only hero in ice that hits the edges of the cost uh, of the uh, for enemy formation. Let's go to Rosola. A very quickie. Today is a quickie. <laughs> hero analysis. There's nothing there. So original was again a dagger holder becomes a ranger. Bypass dodgy becomes bypass. They have ensured that the legendaries stay juicy and are pulled for whoever is blah enough to pull. Uh, <clears throat> why are they introducing? Maybe somebody wants to pull somebody else and you know, this is the one that shows up. Um, they have added, of course, there is only one uh, passive that exists on the original, which is duration of the first three status ailments character receives is decreased by one. It is still there and there is an additional one. Uh, after this character casts their special skill, all allies deal plus 70% increased normal attack and special skill damage against targets with boosted health. So it's a very, very conditional boosted health. Uh, now, boosted health has to be beaten down after glorifying it for two years, three years almost. So stats have got boosted because of this. <clears throat> <laughs> and yes, the legendary troops will get these mana bonus benefits. So 11 plus 5 is equal to 16 and all good. Plus this fellow is already very fast, so he doesn't need so much. So um, the costume version uh, has a higher, a little bit higher attack. And the original version has a little bit higher HP. Uh, vengeful backstab becomes artful backstab. <laughs> I mean, they don't even have creativity to come with the name of the specials. Uh, okay, so costume deals 300 damage to the target, hit one, goes into hiding for two turns. Everything is the same. 330 damage and everything is the same. <laughs> so in the main uh, hero, the damage was a little higher, direct damage, and uh, comes out of hiding. 313 damage to all enemies who used special skills. So here the damage is lower at 300, but when it comes out, 357 damage to all enemies. So it's still um, whatever. So that's it. I mean, what to say? Uh, uh, hit one, but when it comes out of hiding, uh, becomes a hit all, but um, Conditionally, obviously, if the targets targets only those who have used special skills, whether it's a healer or whether it's any support hero or anything. So not high impact hero. I will just leave it at that. So that's the hero analysis of the two fellows that have basically shown up as new in this uh, portal. So that's that. Thanks for watching and cheers.